Mitch Robinson, MouthpieceSports.com. We're here with Fred Hubner, celebrity caller at Hawthorne, Hawthorne Raceway. And Fred, uh, you're a, a personality with the score. Uh, you know, we know you can talk. Uh -huh. Have you ever had uh, an experience like this? Well, to be honest, I used to recreate races for a 976 and 900 numbers we used to do with horse racing. I only know one kind of 976 yeah, I know. number. I know. That's why I usually don't tell many people that. That's the only ones they know. But we used to recreate races, but we would do it off the charts. So we wouldn't say, you know, this horse is there and the other person is coming on the outside, we'd make it up. Well, now I can't make it up because it's happening in front of me. So it'll be interesting. As you prepare to make the call, knowing that uh, worldwide, uh, millions of people mm -hmm. watching us, what, what are the butterflies doing? Uh, they're jumping a bit because, uh, you know, I haven't picked many winners this, this meet at, uh, at Hawthorne, and I've tried, but uh, it would be nice if I actually get all the calls right. My biggest problem is I'm worried I'm going to say a number instead of a name. Here's my question. Do you have a vested interest in any horse that is actually running in the third at Hawthorne today? I made, I made sure I did, actually. I, I think I put $5 and went on the five. Five on the five. Five on the five. So your call can dramatically change as the five comes down the backstretch. Yeah, well, the odds are my first call is going to have my horse in, in the lead or at the very end. <laughs> with my luck, usually at the very end. Uh, which is tough for preparing to spend uh, three hours on the air with Mike North or uh, calling a race. Uh, there's no doubt that spending time with Mike North is, is tougher. <laughs> Perfect. Good luck. We'll talk to you after the race. Thanks a lot. All righty. And they're off. Blazing prize holding on to a slim lead with chosen deputy right there in second. Star Vector in third up on the outside. It's Mundo Perfecto. First quarter in 25, the half in 49.75. They go to the far turn with blazing pride. They had the best of it, still does. A little more than a length. Star Vector right there in second with Mundo Perfecto, followed by Chosen Deputy. On the inside, Heap Wampum making up some room. Beat the Freeze also looking for some racing room on the inside. We're for real. Up on the outside trying to make a move. Mundo Perfecto is back. They turn for home. Heap Wapham first. Blazing Prize finished second. Beat the Freeze third to third here at Hawthorne.